That pump should not be that noisy. All right, let's go over what an air leveling suspension is. Now this typically comes on SUVs, but it could also come on some pickup trucks. The purpose of this type of suspension is when you're loading up the vehicle, when you have a lot of tongue weight or payload, your vehicle is gonna tend to sag in the back. Air leveling suspension is designed to counteract that sag. These vehicles don't rely on just the airbags to get the vehicle at the correct ride level. They also have coil springs and the airbags assist those coil springs. So in the event that they're not working right, you may not even notice until you load up the back of the vehicle. If it turns out that you need airbags or air shocks and a compressor, you can get those at warningauto.com. So let's talk about some of the things you may notice if your air leveling suspension is going bad. One of the first most obvious things you may notice is when the vehicle is loaded up, it seems like it's squatting in the back. Or you may get a suspension warning light on your dash and you're gonna need a scan tool to check out those codes. You wanna take a listen to the compressor. It may be noisier than usual or it may be running longer than usual. If you notice that, there's probably a leak in the system or it may not even be running at all. When you first start the vehicle, you may hear the compressor start up. It should not necessarily come on every time you start the vehicle and you may hear it cycle once in a while while driving around, but it should not be constantly cycling on and off or constantly running. And lastly, you wanna do a visual inspection of all the air suspension components, the air compressor, the lines, and the shocks or the airbags. Let's take a look at the air pump on this vehicle. It's located right here. This is way in the back. And you can see it's not looking so good. A lot of corrosion in there. This is aluminum and there's some steel in there and aluminum and steel next to each other with corrosion type weather is gonna cause this. And you can actually see where there's a crack and that's not good. One way to check the airbags to see if they're leaking is just spraying them down with some soapy water. Just like checking a tire if you have a leak. If you see any bubbles, anything bubbling up, that's where you have a leak. The side looks good, now let's check out the other side. Oh, we can see a little bit of bubbles right there. So we got a leak there, bigger leak up there. So that's from the rubber moving back and forth. When the compressor was bad, the rubber is doing a lot of movement and you're getting some leaks from it because it weakened the rubber. Since we have noise and a crack in the compressor, we're gonna replace it with a new one. We're also gonna replace the shocks because they are leaking, but they also come in a kit with the air compressor as well. Now that we have the new pump in, let's see how it sounds. That compressor sounds a lot better. So if your air ride suspension is sagging, you can get your parts at 1AAuto.com. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to our channel, ring the bell, turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of our videos.
Yeah. 